What's up guys, Marty Gras Man 23 here and this is another Lego quick hit. Lego thoughts for Lego minds. So guys, I have a question for you. Do you display your Lego sets or do you store your Lego sets? Obviously the big question is if you're going to display them, do you have enough room? Do you have a Lego city? Um, do you keep it all on the shelves on the wall? Or do you just, do you build them and then do you store them? I'll give you an example. So I just built this set right here. This is a very, very cool set. As you guys know, it's an older set. I say old, what is it, about a year and a half old maybe? So anyway, I finally got around to getting this set, built it, love it. But I don't plan on displaying it because I don't have the space. I don't have a Lego room, so to speak, or a Lego city. But I don't want to tear that set apart, so what I'll do is I will probably either set it over there with the rest of them that's just creating a big pile, or I'll put that in a Ziploc bag so that way I'm sure that all the pieces stay together, and I'll put it in a tote or a drawer or a box or something. So that's my question to you. Do you store your Lego sets complete? Do you take them back apart, save the original box, put all the parts in a bag, stick them in the box, and, and you have the set or do you just build it once and whenever you get around to it, you might steal parts from it or it might be, that set might be built and in your big tote of bricks and you don't ever do anything with it until you need pieces to rob from it. So what kind of, what kind of Lego collector are you? Are you a displayer? Are you a store? Or we'll even open up Pandora's box. Are you a hoarder? So leave me some comments below, guys. What's your techniques? How do you store it? How do you display it? Do you do one or the other? Do you try to do both? Leave me some comments below. That's all for this one. As always, thanks for watching. I really appreciate the support. And until the next one, we'll talk again. <laughs>